Hi guys, Melissa here. Welcome back to Cloud Mom. Responding to a comment from a follower named Casey Harton, who is commenting on a video I did about disciplining your child when they're having a tantrum in public and how you should handle that. And here's what Casey said. I thought it was a great comment. She writes, my problem with ignoring my daughter when I throw, when she throws a tantrum in public is that strangers will walk up to her and ask her what's wrong or try to give her candy or something like that. Some people have even yelled at her because they think somebody needs to get on to her. My daughter would actually rather be yelled at than be completely ignored. People don't believe that my daughter is well behaved at home because she acts absolutely horrible in public. Let me know if other people have this problem. Maybe it's where I live. I wish other people would just mind their own business, let the child's parents handle the situation. So, Casey, I have to say I totally agree with you. If you are dealing with a temper tantrum in public and trying to deal with it, trying to control it, trying to discipline and teach your child, I think that's your parenting moment. And I actually think it's very inappropriate for other people, strangers, to walk up and make comments and try to console your daughter because they have no idea what's happened. So to me, that's a big distraction. And I don't think that it's right that other people should do that. So I support you and I know how hard it is. I have been there and it's really, really embarrassing. I find it really embarrassing when my kids misbehave in public. I find it almost more embarrassing when they misbehave in front of, you know, family members or friends, you know, less my sister because we're so close, we don't judge each other, but more extended family members and friends. Um, this summer, the hardest was the fighting between my boys. We're actually very, very close. They love each other very much, but they're close in age. They're very competitive with sports and things like that. And they tend to get in big fights when they play soccer and whatever. And it's just awful. So, I mean, just to draw an analogy, if I'm trying to deal with one of those children who I think hasn't done the right thing and explain to them what I think they need to be doing and a stranger or a family member is coming in and like giving them candy, I think it would be very disruptive. So I agree. And other people, please weigh in. What do you think? Do you think it's right for strangers to intervene in a situation like this? Or shouldn't the parent be left to discipline their child as they see fit? As long as it's not a situation that rises to the level of, you know, anything that's unsafe for the child. Anyway, thank you so much for writing in about this. I really appreciate it. Thanks so much for watching Cloud Mom and Thanks for commenting, and I will see you soon.